Hey everybody, welcome to the vlog. Alright, 20 days. I have 20 days. I was just looking for my phone and I realized I'm using my phone so I can't show you. But I have a countdown. 20 days until I fly out of here and go home. I'm flying to the Philippines. It's been over a year and a few weeks. Last time I, well no actually... I take that back. The last time I was there was just after Christmas, but uh, also the last time when I flew there was in early September. I think it was early September. It was September. Um, so, uh, right now I am going to have dinner. I'm going to have some steak. Okay, here we go. Excuse any mess you might have seen. This one? Ah. ah. Found it. Now, I am looking for the George Foreman grill. Be right back. Gonna heat up some uh, mashed potatoes. I'm not eating all of this. It's... I know I'm fat, but trust me, I'm not e eating all of this. <laughs> Warm and grill is ready for um, cooking. Let's see how this goes. Now I gotta set the timer to cook the steak for five minutes. I'm excited to go to the Philippines. Uh, my saw was there, and my many many dogs. Now started off with one, then we had two, and it blew up after that. But I do love them. They're great dogs. And uh, what's going to be great about this time around is my intentions are, and will be that I will be staying in the Philippines. I will only come back here to the States in about a couple of years and to do some uh, medical work I need to be done uh, in a couple of years. It's days later, and I'm sharing the moment of my amateur unboxing of my iPhone 15 Pro Max natural titanium color. One is my Asawa's iPhone, and the other is my iPhone. For me, this is exciting because the last iPhone I have is the iPhone 12 Pro Max. 
I purposely go a few years apart on getting the next iPhone. I always enjoy this part. Here we have the USB-C berated charging cable. I find it is better quality over what they used to have for years. The first time I saw a cable like this was on my iMac and then on my 15 inch MacBook Air. Here we have the Apple sticker. Then we have the usual paperwork that I will hold up for you to read. Designed by Apple in California. Hey everybody. Alright, this is my review about my iPhone Pro Max. I've had it for a few days now. And I think it's great. I really do. I've had, well actually I have it right here. I have the iPhone this is the iPhone 12 and this is the iPhone 13 I mean 15 and I normally don't go between I don't normally get a new phone every uh, every year one that would be expensive and two I like to see a big difference in technology so it's been, see, that was 12, this is 15, so it's been three years. And um, I could see a difference. The shape is pretty much the same. It is nice and round compared to the other one. So it, that is kind of nice. And the screen is actually a little bit bigger, even though physically the phone is, about, I think it's identical with measurements. The camera, which is really the big difference this thing really zooms really really well and uh i'm glad i got it i'm truly am glad i got it and i chose the uh titanium natural as i mentioned earlier and i also want to say for those that you, you hear that chirping sound it's a smoke detector and i had you know this is a little off topic but I've had some people make comments in one of my other videos when they heard that chirping going off. Um, I replaced all the batteries. Hasn't made a difference yet. So I don't know what the problem is. It could be I just need to replace the whole thing. But back to what's more important about the iPhone. So I got two of them. I have the one that I just showed you and then the, I have one for my Asawa as in the Philippines. And she got the blue one. I uh, would show that to you guys, but I already have it wrapped up. But if you saw in the clip before this, you saw I had them uh, lined uh, side by side. And her box was open a little bit because I had opened it to uh, make sure it works before I left the country to give it to her. But uh, once I got that all sorted out, I closed it up, wrapped it up so she can enjoy the experience of opening it herself so um, if you haven't gotten the iPhone 15 Pro Max which is what I got then I would recommend it now the iPhone 
was it iPhone 15 plus? I mean, I don't know, from what I could tell, they, they look like the same phones physically. But technology-wise, there's a slight difference. Either way, any iPhone you go with is a good choice, I think. I've, I've had an iPhone since the second one. IPhone, I've had an iPhone 2 all the way up to now. And I would say my favorite, my favorite iPhone I ever had was the 5S. It, it's just, I like the size of it. I don't know, just something about it, it was, I just thought it was my favorite. And I remember back in the, back around that time, I used to make fun of, I think it was Samsung or some other phone carriers that had phones that were like really big. And I used to make fun of them, like that's crazy. Well, I became a hypocrite because uh, I think when I got the iPhone 10, I think, uh, I think that was the one that I got was a bigger phone and I've stayed with it ever since because the screen is bigger so it's easier to, to read stuff and play games and stuff but yeah I would say the iPhone 5s was my most favorite one and sometimes I wish they would make it again but they won't so I also want to I, I, I did show this in one of my other videos I made uh, some time back I think that I still have the case for it the, the um, headphones for the uh, this is the second version of the um, AirPod Pro yeah AirPod Pro you can't see it too well can you anyways trust me that's what it says and um, I like it it works just as they advertise I was listening to it. I had it on where if you start talking, the music either stops or, it, well, yeah, actually it stopped. And I actually, um, I had it on and I, I said something. And all of a sudden a, a, vo a record or a voice from the headphones ex told me that what, they're, what it was doing. The only thing I found, I don't know why, but I don't remember, because I, I had the first original version of the uh, AirPod Pros and some reason maybe it's the the tip I'm using may be the wrong size but it seems to me like it hurts my ears after a while just sitting in there so I'm gonna have to play around with that but technology wise it's great just like they advertised and I got it in a rush because um, you know I'm gonna be traveling in another few weeks and um, it will help hopefully it has that noise cancellation so hopefully it will cut down on the noise of the engine as I'm flying it won't be as good as uh, over the ear headphones but it, it's better than nothing I would hope at least it would be better than what they give you on the planes so I'm happy with that I also have which I can't show you because I'm using my laptop as uh, my camera but I have the uh, MacBook Air 15 inch. <laughs> and I'm, I got the base model, basically. And I think it's wonderful. I like the size of the screen. And it's weird, just like with anything else, you know, just like with the iPhone, which is when you first see it, you're thinking, wow, this thing's big. But then after you've used it for a while, you realize, oh, it's really not that big. You get so used to the size. But then when you compare it to maybe another laptop, for example, a smaller screen, then you notice the difference. Same thing with the uh, iPhones. Oh, I also want to say one other thing about the iPhone. I was curious, so, you know, I took this case off because I was thinking maybe I could save money by reusing this case for the uh, new phone, it will not work. It will not fit. And I, I, I believe the reason is the uh, cameras here, these on the 12 are much flatter. Whereas these, 
these stick up a little bit higher. Hey everybody, I want to apologize for the suddenness of the video stopping. Um, I was interrupted, so I had to cut it off. But I just want to add one more thing because this video has gone really long, which is about the weight of the of the iPhones. Yes, I can feel a slight difference. And it's not major, but you do feel a slight difference. And when I, after a while, you find, or I find, I should say, that I lose the sense the sense of how light the phone feels like it was when I first got it. I guess my uh, senses have gotten used to the weight of the phone. But when you hold the my old phone, the iPhone 12 Pro Max, to this one, you do feel a slight difference. It's not a major difference, but it, there is a slight difference. That's all I wanted to add. I hope you guys have a wonderful day or night. Take care of yourself and the ones you love.